speaker, Madam Speaker, we stand guided as your communication. But Madam Speaker, as you are aware, this is a house of records and a house of procedure. And the last communication that we had from the substantive speaker was that he is going to deliver a ruling on the issue of the majority and minority on Thursday the 6th at 2.30 p.m. Yes. It's in the answer, Madam Speaker. And the answer will bear me witness that the speaker pronounced himself on the floor of the house that he is going to deliver his ruling at 2.30 p.m. And now it is 2, it is 2, how many? 2.45, it is 2.44 now. We are late by 14 minutes, Madam Speaker. 14 minutes is, we are late. So Madam Speaker, unless the ruling is not ready, or unless that uh, the law has taken its course and uh, wisdom has befallen on the, on, on the leadership of this house, and they have realized that uh, uh, Azimio is the majority and we move forward, Madam Speaker, so that we can move the country forward, Madam Speaker, so that we don't, as my colleague, the Kiharu MP alluded to, we don't keep the country in paralysis and we don't keep the parliament in anxiety. The rule of law is clear, as the lawyers say. The law is very clear. There are many lawyers in this house, some of them senior lawyers. I think Murangara is here. So the lawyers are here. The law is very clear, Madam Speaker. So can we authoritatively say that the decision has been made in silence, that Azimio is the majority party in the house, and we move forward, Madam Speaker, and we conduct business as it is known in the parliament, Madam Speaker. Honorable member, uh, Honorable member, I think you're out of order. You have no power or authority to make a ruling on that point. I think the Honorable Speaker clearly communicated that he shall give his ruling on this session that starts at 2.30 p.m. and ends at 8 p.m. So until such time as we get to 8 p.m., we, we still have the time. 